Well, hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. Today, I've got Honor's Confetti Cupcake, and I'm going to stamp it. I have started off with Neltique's Formula 2 and Moonshine Manny's Honor's Confetti Cupcake. And I topped it off with Pro FX Quick Dry Top Coat. I will be using this acrylic plate XYL12 today. I'll be using this image by my thumb, some little squares, and then this other image of some squares, or a third, kind of hard to see. My Faber Nail Scraper and my Bundle Monster Monocle Stamper. I'll also be using Yellow Stopper and Funky Fingers Dark Knight to stamp with. Now these plates are really hard for you to see the images on. I've tried using darker backgrounds, lighter backgrounds, it doesn't matter. It's just they're hard to see. So you kind of got to know what, what you're going for and where, where it is on the plate. Hold it up to the light and get an idea of where you want it. And I don't think I got a really great scrape on that one, but you know, it's all good. It's a little more distressed looking and you know, that is fine. I am cleaning that acrylic plate with pure acetone and a cotton ball, just so you know. And what it is, is I've, I've misplaced my favorite scraper, <laughs> my clear jelly stamper scraper. Um, it, it, so I'm having to use another one and there's a learning curve with it. Okay, I, I don't think I like that one. I'm going to just swipe that and do, do another one. Just because you get it on the stamper don't mean you have to use it. And I have to remind myself of that quite often. Um, so we are going to do a do-over on that one. And I am doing like a little bit of a roll technique for my pickup. Seems to work good with the stamper and this plate. So there we go. We've got that just square image on most of my nails. I am doing this image down here. It's got some open squares and some open squares with little squares in it. <laughs> I just thought that, that would look cute. So there we go. Plop, plop, plop it on the nail. So there we go. We've got a bunch of squares all over the place. And I'm going to use a little piece of tape to get up some of this excess stampin' polish from around my fingers. And this one's coming up really well. I love that Dark Knight from Funky Fingers for Stampin'. It's just a really great regular polish that works great as a stamping polish. Now I'm going to go in with my e.l.f. cleanup brush and some acetone and just do a little bit more cleaning up here around my nails. Nothing crazy or nothing, just, you know, just got to do a little bit of cleanup. And I'm going to top this with the Bundle Monster Smudge Free Top Coat before I use my regular top coat. Um, as you can see, it does not smear. It does stink a little bit, but I mean, nothing crazy. It doesn't stink as bad as my Clean Colors or my Mundo de Unis, but it does stink. I'm just going to throw that out there. And now we're going to top it off with some of the Pro FX Quick Dry Top Coat. So that it can all dry quickly. <laughs> hey Woody, how you doing? So there we go. That is it. Very simple manicure today. Here's my swatch photo. I hope you enjoyed this one. Leave me a comment down below and let me know what you think. That is it for today. Thanks for watching. Until next time, be good to yourself.